Good morning. It's 5.30 in the morning uh, and it's around the island race today. This river in about an hour and a half's time is going to be absolute mayhem and out there over 1,000 boats. It's over 1,100 entries. Um, as you can see there's not a lot of wind so it's going to be quite a tricky start. Um, I am pleased to say I actually managed to sleep last night. That's not always a given since the Vendée Globe. I don't always sleep. Uh, so I'm just going to uh, wolf my breakfast down and then toddle along through the Royal Yacht Squadron which is up there um, and I get to fire the starting cannon before going out and having a bit of a race myself. Um, 30 seconds. I'm on the platform at the squadron and behind me the starting sequence is in progress so we've already had the warning signal um, we're about to get the preparatory signal there's a time check first I think out there you can see everyone is starting to line up and I'm going to be firing the start gun. I've had my briefing. It's all go. Four, three, two, one, go. We're round the corner, round the first corner. The needles are back there. And that is one of the most iconic sites of the Round the Island race. When you make it around the corner and look behind you and there are hundreds of multicolored spinners. I love that. Um, we are doing okay on Yeah. <laughs> it's snack time, so Tom's eating. Uh, we're doing alright. Um, we've chosen a code zero, so um, we're using a slightly smaller flatter sail to get up this way. Different to our competitors, but it's going all right. We're just coming up to see Catherine's point now, and just there in the murk ahead of us, you can see the lighthouse. Um, I just need to get my way back up to Windward because the breeze went forward. So, everyone around us just on jibs can't see that far behind because it is quite murky but it looks like when we get to the corner we will be putting our spinnaker up Let's see how it goes very shallow here so we can't go any further that way. Wind's got a bit fluky. Uh, we're going to have to concentrate for this last bit um, but the end is in sight. 